let's make a party. Today we're gonna take some red wine, a little bit of rum, and some delicious fruit. Mix them together and have a party perfect sangria. For this sangria recipe, I like to use one lemon, one lime, one orange, one pear, one apple, and about a cup of grapes sliced in half. Each of the other fruits I'm going to slice thinly so that I have a high degree of the inside of the fruit to the wine and the rum. Take the time to remove the seeds from your lemons and think about saving some of the fruit that you are slicing up as garnish for the rim of your wine glasses. The apples I'm cutting crosswise so I'll have a pretty apple slice in the glass. Sangria is a festive cocktail, so choose a really pretty pitcher to mix all of your ingredients in so they can be visible and it will entice your guests to want to drink your sangria. Also, give some thought to the glass that you're going to serve your sangria in. You want that to have the ability to show the colors of the drink and really lend itself to the whole festive experience. To make the sangria, I've added all the fruit to a, my pretty pitcher. I've reserved some fruit for the garnish for the glasses, and now we're making the cocktail. We're going to add one bottle of a fruity red wine. One and a half cups of dark spiced rum and one cup of fresh orange juice. Then stir it around a bit, muddling the fruit so you start to get some of those fruity deliciousness flavors starting to mix with the wine and the rum and the orange juice. And then just pop it into the fridge until you're ready to serve. When it's party time, you'll want to put plenty of ice in the glass, use tongs or a slotted spoon to select some of the fruit, or you can let your guests do this, prepare their own sangria. But you want to make sure that you have plenty of delicious fruit. Then add the sangria to the glass. Some of your guests will want to drink their sangria straight up from the pitcher. Others will want to be topped with a little bit of seltzer or maybe some lemon lime soda. That would be delicious. Don't forget the garnish. It makes a party. 